Happy 2024. Welcome to the Totally Designs channel. If you like to create, you like to grow, you like to know, or you simply just want to come and hang out, go ahead and press that like and subscribe button along with that notification bell so you can be notified each and every time I go live or upload a brand new video. Now, I hope you enjoy today's video. Hey YouTube family, it's Kesa from Totally Designs and I am going to be continuing my paint-a-thon that you guys know I started the other day. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be introducing another color. This color is called Neon Pink. Neon Pink and it's like a rose fluorescent. And I did buy this from Michael's Arts and Craft by the way. And then I have another one that I'm going to be introducing as well, and it's the orange. So I'm going to be trying that out on this blank canvas right here. And then what will happen is I'll combine some colors. I'll play around with some colors. Now just watch me as I go ahead on the journey. As I said before, go ahead and get your supplies your everything or whatever you're working on and let's paint together let's conversate together and let's just get some work done together how about that all right as you can see i'm just going ahead and brushing this across i think this is actually going to turn out great y'all because the color right now is really really nice um from what i can see how it's spreading on there already so I'm gonna really be able to do something really creative with this particular earring plank. As I stated before, it doesn't take that long to paint. It does take a little while to dry. Takes five to 10 minutes, depending on how many coats you have placed upon the canvas. Um, today is Tuesday, y'all, and it's been a very interesting day, to say the least. To say the least. I hope your Tuesday has brought some creativity to you, some joy, and peace. I am still recovering from a head cold, but it's getting a lot better. I've been taking my zinc and vitamin C and getting my rest, and that has really uh, been helping out a lot, along with prayer. All right, look at that, y'all. Isn't that gorgeous right there? As you can see, it didn't take that long. I will wind up doing another coat. Uh, only because it's it's light, but I kind of want it to be a little bit more vibrant. Okay, now we're going on to this one. I am experimenting with different colors. I know there's one, and I did mention in the other video that April had mentioned to me. I'm going to try to go online tonight to Amazon and order that. And I think she's also said it's uh, you can the, it's called color shifting. And I think she said you can also get it from Walmart. So I am going to be trying different colors simply because. It's good to try something new every now and then. Now, you don't have to uh, paint this in a uh, particular pattern. Your goal is just to get the paint on top. <clears throat> that is just your goal, okay? To get it on here and get this painting done. You can always go over any areas you feel like have little imperfections and <clears throat> go from there. Oh, that's beautiful, y'all. All right, I am going to be using my my paint. I forgot what it's called. I hold my paintbrushes. It's a paintbrush holder. 
and I did get that from Tamu in case you guys are wondering and there will be a link just in case you want to know where I got it from all right now I am opening up this other paint here and I'm just gonna do that all right now I'm interested to see what this orange is going to look like. And then I may do a combination. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so I am going to do this. Oh, that's going to be pretty, y'all. Oh, yeah, that's amazing. And I don't um, necessarily know if I'm going to need to put a second coat. Because as you can see, it's coming out pretty good. Um, just from this one coat that I'm applying. But again, you never know. I may decide, hey, it needs a second coat. I hope these uh, videos that I'm doing are inspiring you to um, get more creative with the things that you're making. I know every time you guys leave a comment telling me how much you're enjoying the videos, it really blesses me to know that there's something that I am doing that is beneficial to someone else. And that's always what I want to do is to always be a blessing or influence people in the right direction, especially towards their passion, you know? Okay, now as you can see, that is really nice, but I might do another coat. I'm not sure, y'all. Now, my goal is always to see how many canvases I can paint with a certain amount of time. I'm never in a rush, but I always want to challenge myself to see if I can always do more, you know? And I have not um, done the other video yet. I will be releasing that once I record it to give you the finishing touches on the earrings that I've already done. I'm going to be adding some decor to it. A little decoration to make the earring quite interesting. Now, I think I'm gonna do uh, probably a two-tone color as well. And I might even do three, I don't know. It depends on how I feel. And let's see how fast I can move through these canvases right there. Oh, that is, oh, I, I'm, listen, those colors are vibing to me. I'm gonna set them aside, let those dry over there. And let's see if I can combine maybe a blue with the orange. That's kind of, that's going to be kind of fascinating. And I want to see if I want to use my Peacock. And it is called Peacock, y'all. Peacock blue. Um, I want to see if I have it handy. If I don't, I'm just going to go ahead and use another blue. But I do have all my paint supplies near me. This so was easy for me to find, but you know, when you're working on something, sometimes it doesn't work out that way. <laughs> anyway, I'm just gonna go ahead and use this um this bright blue. We're gonna see how that works. And I want to see if I have one open because I bought a few of them, y'all, because I'm liking the colors so far. No, well, you know what, guys? Let's try yellow. I'm interested to see something here. <clears throat> I do have the yellow handy. And I want to see how that, that yellow and that neon and all those different colors work together. I am just, you know, y'all know I'm a color girl. Y'all know I like that. Okay, let's see what we can do. That's very interesting. We're going to start off with this yellow. We're going to do something weird, maybe. 
something like that. We're gonna see. Okay, we're gonna. I'm just gonna move it all around a little bit. Not necessarily having a pattern, y'all. Just doing something random. And what I realized, y'all, I have not done a pair of these type of earrings in this neon yellow so i'm probably gonna do one in yellow just because now i see oh you haven't done that okay there we are there we are there we are all right we're gonna add a little bit more to that just to kind of break it up all right now oh so i get for laying it where it shouldn't be. Now we're gonna take some of this pink and we're gonna splash it all in there. And then I'm gonna show you something else I'm gonna do too. I'm gonna do something random. Now I'm not making this perfect y'all because I am gonna blend it all together when I get the other color I'm gonna blend in there with it. So this is gonna look messy for a minute. Okay. Now I'm gonna add in that orange over here. That's spicy, y'all. Okay, we're gonna do the same thing for this side over here. Okay, now I am going to take <clears throat> another brush and I'm going to smooth this all together. I'm just going to do some zigzagging and rounding and, and all that good stuff. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to mesh it all together. Going to mesh it. Mesh it. <laughs> mesh it all together. Okay, I'm going to do the same thing with this side. And if I feel like I need to add like more coating on it, I will. But right now I'm just going to kind of tweak it a little bit. Okay, so what I think I might do is add a little bit of more yellow at the bottom just to fix this part right here. up here okay now I'm going to do the same thing I did before oh this is beautiful y'all at least in my mind it is I love it Oh yes, that is so fun, y'all. Now I'll just do the back one basic color. I'm not gonna um, do all of what I did right there. 
I'm just going to basically do that. Okay. Now moving on to the next canvas, I want to try some other things. This time I'm going to, I think I'm going to do the yellow and the blue. I'm um, not the yellow and the blue, but the yellow and the neon pink, just cause I like that color. Now I am going to put like a thicker coat on here because I don't really want to necessarily have to go over this again once I add the second coating on here, meaning the second color. Okay, there we go. Okay. Okay. I'm going to put that down really quickly. Now I'm going to go back to the pink. Gonna add that together. Oh, this is gonna be very nice. Yeah, oh, look at that, y'all. Isn't that pretty? It's amazing what you'll come up with if you just allow your mind to relax and don't overthink it. Just don't overthink it, just do it. Just simply do it. Like Nike said, just do it. Okay, y'all, look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. Mmm. I like that. I'm feeling this vibe right here. Now, I don't know if I'm going to add a... A sticker on this one or not I'm not sure I'm gonna play that by ear all right so let's do the next one I'm doing pretty good on time this time y'all because I'm more I guess focused on what I want to do you get a lot done when you're focused Today I managed to do some laundry. I washed my bedding, put my bedding back on after I washed it and washing other clothes. And I feel like I've accomplished a whole lot. Not a lot, but a lot. You know what I mean? It's always just good to sleep in a fresh bed and especially after you've been dealing with a little bit of a cold, you always wanna wash your linen. Alrighty, okay guys, that is beautiful. Okay, we're going to go and deal with that pink over here. Now guys, I do suggest you keep wipes over here because your hands will get dirty with paint. I do have some, I just haven't bothered to reach for them to wash this off my hands yet. I will. Aren't these colors beautiful though, y'all? I love this. Even though this is like spring vibes, it doesn't matter. We're getting ready to go on the spring. Listen, guys, have you seen how fast we've left February and now we are upon March? My goodness gracious, dandelions. Time waits for no man. And if you don't use your time wisely, then you will waste <laughs> would have wasted a whole bunch of time doing a whole lot of nothing and that is just not what i am about these days i want to 
use my time wisely as much as I can anyway okay y'all so I had to go over that a little bit and I'm gonna go I'm gonna add some more of this pink and then I'm actually gonna do those yellow earrings y'all that I was actually I did do a yellow pair but I don't know maybe I just didn't do it in this in this particular style so I'm gonna I'm gonna do one in just yellow just because now I asked a question to you guys the other day and I asked you why is it that you do what you do a couple of you answered um I'm just curious are you enjoying what you're doing is it is it really your passion hmm tell me about it I like to hear it okay we're gonna go ahead and put that away okay guys I'm setting those aside I'm gonna let them dry and I always want to fully let them dry this is almost dry and then I'm gonna actually add another coat to that right now I'm gonna do these yellow bright yellow bright yellow 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 you know what's funny I am I'm a blue girl but there's something about yellow y'all I like yellow I've been told by people oh you look great in yellow I'm like oh okay thank you didn't know I don't know I think certain people have like their they have a color that's really complementary to their skin tone um I think it's, there's a definite um, symmetry to that. Like certain things just look good on certain people. Would y'all say? Would y'all say? All right, y'all. <laughs> All righty. This is what I'm talking about. Now again, guys, you can add another coat on it depending on what you want, how you want the earring to look. There's no rules to that. Um, you add what you wanna add. I know some of us paint beads, others paint canvases like me. I'm not so much into the bead painting. I can do it, but I like to do this. This is what I like to do. I really enjoy this part of it. Yeah. Yay. Now, I don't know how many I've done. If you guys want to let me know if I broke my record from the other one. Let me know. Just say, hey, Casey, you know, you you painted two more than you did in the other video. I don't know. We'll see. All right. Now, I'm going to paint one more. And then I think this time I'm just going to do that orange and yellow. Just because I'm on this, I don't know, shock value. I don't know. <laughs> what do you call it? I just think the combination looks good. How about that? We don't have to name uh, nothing fancy for it, I, you know, unless you want to. I mean, we can name something fancy. It's fancy. Okay, we're gonna start off with this beautiful, vibrant orange. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and kind of even it out. So it'll be a two-tone. Look at that. How gorgeous is this, y'all? Okay, and that, we have a little piece of hair from the brush in there. I'll just have to take that out of there. What is your favorite uh, brush to use? Do you have a favorite paintbrush or favorite uh, brand that you like to use? I don't, I'm still discovering um, 
which ones are are good and which ones are I would leave um still okay Alrighty, we're going on to this one. Oh, this is going to be very pretty, y'all. This is going to be pretty, too. Somebody is going to like these earrings right here. And that somebody might be me. How about that? I did quite a bit of these. Um, if you guys can tell me how many I did in this video versus the other video, or it's the same amount, let me know. And so I'm just spreading this out a little bit because there's a lot I placed on here. So I got to kind of spread it out. Sorry if I took it off camera, y'all. Okay, we're going to let that dry a little bit. And I will go over that and fix that. Don't worry. I'm just going to let it dry. I don't want to over uh, paint it right now. Um, and when you are making corrections in your painting, don't overpaint it at that moment. Just allow it to dry. And then once it dries, you can paint over it. Because putting too much paint on there, just it'll, it'll mess it up. We tend to want to overcorrect before the project is dried. I know I do. Okay, so this is really, okay, there we are. I like that. Let's take little br uh, strokes, brush strokes. You could turn it to the side. You could make it even, or make it flat. I should say, not even. Okay. And we're just gonna do this. Take it down that way. Okay, there we go. Now we're gonna add in the yellow. We're gonna complete this by adding in that yellow. Okay, y'all, I need to add a little bit more yellow over here because I ran out of yellow. I want to say thank you to all my new subscribers and my returning subscribers. And I hope that you truly are enjoying this painting series that I'm doing. I call it a paint-a-thon. So again, I'm not going to overcorrect right now because I am going to let it dry. And I may have to do another coat. Hopefully, I won't. Okay, I've done mm, two. I think I did six in this one. Um, but I do want to, again, say thank you to all my new subscribers and my returning subscribers. 
you guys opinions are invaluable and i appreciate you stopping by and watching everything that i'm doing right now oh i did find my by the way guys i did find the peacock blue so while i have you here i'm just gonna do that peacock blue and that uh that neon how about that y'all this will be the last one for this video and then off camera what i'll do is i'll uh do the back sides and come back because the back side i'm only going to do like one coat on the back side okay so this is that peacock blue which i really love that um it reminds me of a coat but a coat back uh Cobalt, cobalt, excuse me. And I just dropped my my brush. <laughs> oh. Um it's that dark dark blue, but it's a beautiful blue. It's amazing um of the different blues that they come up with. I don't know what how they name them. I wonder how they come up with these names. Because I know every blue is not the same blue, no matter how they they say it is. Okay. All right. I'm just going to show you one of the earrings that I'm going to do because I'm going to cut the video after this but I just want to show you what that was going to look like right there oh that's going to be something there y'all too oh my goodness all right look at that well guys thank you for watching and until the next video happy beating